the Capitol and built the building, John Warford, the mayor there, and Mark Luna, uh, an electrician that recently relocated to Bismarck from Arizona to get what else? A job, man! Uh, Mr. Mayor, uh, give us a sense of, of how long has this been going on uh, and just how robust is it? And is it just in Bismarck? Is it throughout the whole state? Give us a little size and scope. Well, Dylan, uh, thanks for having us on. Uh, we have and are so proud of the 2.5% unemployment. It's been going on actually since 2002 when I was first elected. Uh, we've created uh, 10,200 jobs uh, here in the Bismarck metro area. That's a 17% increase since that time. Not only is it an increase in the number of jobs, but the quality of jobs and the income that our citizens have. Uh, just last year, 5% increase across the board as far as the uh, the yearly pay that our citizens receive. So uh, it's a vibrant, robust economy that we have. It's very diverse. We're very proud of it, but we work hard to achieve it. Mark, uh, you moved from Arizona to North Dakota. We're going to get into the weather change in a second. Ha. But before we get to that part of it, uh, let's talk about the, the change in work. Uh, how have you found the lay of the market for you as a, as a professional uh, in North Dakota compared to what you were facing uh, back in Arizona? Uh, it's like night and day, you know. I, uh, there's, I, before I even got to North Dakota, I had people calling me from North Dakota wanting me to come out and, you know, take a look at their, their jobs here. And it's been wonderful here, wonderful for me and my family. I have five children and, and a wife we brought up. So work here is, is, there's a lot of it. Can't say enough about it. Uh, and uh, how is the adaptation from the Arizona lifestyle, which I had to imagine included a certain amount of air conditioning? Uh, in the yard and the house and then to, uh, to the North Dakota lifestyle, which I imagine involves a certain amount of uh, uh, home heating. Well, weather, you know, the weather ain't too bad. You know, 30 below to 115 ain't too bad. So, <laughs> well, you know, we have no AC here. We have nothing but here. Uh, Mr. Mayor, uh, uh, how, have you found, how have you found the sort of the transplants, if you will, from uh, places that are not, uh, that are climatologically different? I, I speak as somebody who grew up about an hour south of Canada and upstate New York, so 30 below zero means something to me. Um, how have you found people making the adaptation? Well, we actually uh, celebrate our four seasons here. Uh, you know, it's a matter of, uh, <laughs> you know, having the quality of life yep. in the community, I think, that draws everybody here. And when you look at the weather, it's actually secondary. You, you look at the other things that we have in our community that draws the people here. Obviously, it's the jobs and the quality of the jobs. But in addition to that, we're one of the safest communities in the United States, one of the top four safest communities. We have great recreational opportunities here, both winter and summer. Uh, we've got, uh, you know, the Golden State uh, Warriors uh, D-League team here. We've got uh, semi-pro hockey. Uh, we've got the Broadway plays. We've got a great civic center bringing in great, uh, great acts. In fact, uh, just a few weeks ago, we had Elton John here, Carrie Underwood. So, you know, we've got really a broad spectrum of quality of life issues here. And uh, most of the people who come here come because of their jobs. And really, uh, the weather is a very, very secondary thing. Mark, what would you to say, so, say to someone in America today, and there's no shortage of someone's in America today, uh, who are looking for work, have been looking for work, are anxious to be productive, to realize their potential, uh, to have meaning in their days and the way that they spend them, provide for their families, all those things that are so critical about a human, uh, human beings and, and work. Uh, what would you say to folks out there uh, that may be entertaining uh, a move like the one that you did? Well, not only the jobs are great up here, the people are wonderful. They've been really, really good to us. And, you know, like I said, the jobs are good. And the, the Bismarck is a great, 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 you know, place to live in. The, the, the and, kids uh, have been okay in school. You know, Your neighbors have been all that. Oh, the community sounds like it's been probably a lot of folks moving there right now, huh? Let's just say I can leave my car on and walk to, in a Walmart, you know, come back my car and be there. So in Arizona, you couldn't do that. But, uh, I just tell you, you think we have great people there. You know, like you said, a lot of jobs, a lot, a lot of jobs. But the people are great here. Yeah. Really, really good people. Uh, and Mr. Mayor, what?